Hey there, Ryan with stickdulcimer.com, coming to you from East Nashville, Tennessee, uh, where we are housed, wearing my East Nashville band shirt, hanging out in an East Nashville recording studio. How much more East Nashville could I get? Blah, 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 blah. I'm sure you don't care unless you're a tourist. All right, today I have got a uh, Woodrow old timer model. This is very similar to the Seagull Merlin. It's four strings with a double top string. If you have questions about that, we've got a ton of different videos about it. I wanted to show you how to play Live Oak uh, by Jason Isbell. One of my favorite songs, one of my favorite artists, also currently in Nashville, a little trend there. Um, there's a variety of ways you could play these songs. I wanna show you the one finger version first, okay? So this is D, D, A, D. That's what it's tuned to. Now, up at the fifth fret, is where you'd find the six minor chord or B minor in the key of D. And the song's in the key of B minor. Or at least when it's transposed it is. Okay, so if you're doing the one finger version, it's B minor, D, E minor, G. B minor, D, E minor, G. And that's it, the whole song is those four chords in that order over and over again, right? So, there's a man who walks beside me, he is who I used to be. And I wonder if she sees him and confuses him with me. I wonder who she's pining for on nights I'm not around. Could it be the man who did the things I'm living down? Okay? That's the one thing, one fingered version. So, if you want to move up from that to slightly more complex chords, the way I like to play it, and I'll show you different fingerings for different chords. This is the B minor, first position. I use my ring finger on the second fret, my middle finger on the first fret, middle string, open top strings, B minor. And the reason I do that is because then I can slide without moving my two fingers here, up two frets, to, and then putting my index finger at the second fret, I get the, the uh, one chord, the D chord. So, so that's the first half of the progression. And then I can either do the one fingered version for the E minor, or I can do the pinky. I like to do pinky because it feels like a good spacing. So bar all three strings, and put my pinky down. And that gives me the full, uh, all three notes of the chord for E minor. And then the really cool thing about that is I just move up two frets to get the G. Again, diatonically fretted instrument, one key, makes stuff like that super easy. So it's B minor, D, E minor, G. I was rougher than the timber, shipping out of Fond du Lac. When I headed south at 17, the sheriff on my back. I never held a lover in my arms or in my gaze. So I found another victim every couple days, right? Now, sometimes what I like to do is mess around with the arrangement of songs. So we'll talk about that for a second. <clears throat> if you want to sing like the recording, if you want to do that style, it's a very laid back style. It's on the uh, it's on the southeastern record, I believe. So there's a man who walks beside me. He is who I used to be. I wonder if she sees him and confuses him with me. Okay, so it's, it's that kind of tempo. I wonder who she's pining for on nights I'm not around. Could it be the man who did the things I'm living down? Real nice and gentle like that. Now. I have got a recording of this song that I did with a buddy in Florida. Totally different, uses stick dulcimers. I'll put it up later for everyone to see. But we decided to kind of rock it out a little bit more. But the night I fell in love with her, I made my weakness known. To the fires and the farmers digging dusty fields alone. The jealous in you windows of the lonely hearted men Let me know what kind of country I was sleeping in Alright, so a little bit 
faster tempo. And a lot of times when I'm doing that, I'm strumming all the all the uh, beats, all the eighth notes, up and down, one and two and three and four and. And I think on our recording we actually went a little faster. to hang around so uh, I hope that gives you the the pieces you need in order to be able to play this song it's a wonderful song go listen to it see what you think kind of get it under your fingers try the one fingered version six six chord which is the fifth fret open first fret third fret okay or these other chords and I guess I should point out that the six minor chord can also be played here. So if you wanted to get a really high and choppy, you could do that for another version. There's a man who walks beside me, he is who I used to be. Just throwing that in there at the end for you. Mess around with it, see what feels good for you. And then if you have any questions, let us know if there's other inversions of chords, which is different shapes of chords that you find that are uh, really cool, that you like a lot. Try those out and let us know what works so that we can kind of fold that into what happens next. All right. Hello at stickdulcimer.com. We'll get us the questions and we'll get back to you. Thanks.